Live, live, live. Yardy Belly is live. Live in the kitchen and live with the fries. Live, live, live. Yardy Belly live. Yardy Belly TV live. Merry Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. <laughs> yes, it is Christmas. Christmas in the morning and good morning guys. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to our kitchen. Mm -hmm. It's Christmas Eve and we are making some fried dumpling. I'm trying to get them perfectly, perfectly browned this morning. We're trying to get them nice and crispy but not tough right right good morning everybody trying to get some not an answer Okay. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to Breakfast Live. Yardy Belly style. Christmas Eve vibes. Mm -hmm. Good morning to you. Good morning. Merry Christmas. Good morning. Good morning. Merry Christmas to one and all. Where two or three are gathered. <laughs> Nothing is wrong with the day. A perfect day. Right. One of those days. Good morning to you and everybody that's watching. We're making fried dumplings. Here's the thing. What thing? Yeah. Good morning, guys. As soon as you hop on, just let us know where you're checking in from. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We need to know what neck of the woods you guys are checking in from. We have some fried dumpling underway. Yes. Trying to get them perfectly brown this morning. So the fire is super duper low. It's a thin line between making the, the fried dumpling nice and crispy and making them overdone so we're trying to gauge it all right all right so good morning to you Ta 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 tanya johnson good mor morning it's morning tanya good, good morning work. check and it in from work. work have a wonderful day to you good morning Michael too Smith. it's nice to see you totalin morris good morning good morning Michigan in the house. Detroit in the house. Hey, hey. baby, baby, come on. Baby, baby, come on. We should have a Christmas version, you know, but <laughs> we're working on it. Breakfast look good. Morning, Michael Smith. Good morning to you. And my dumplings are fast expanding. Why are they expanding so much? They're getting quite poofy and puffy. Isn't that, isn't that the idea though, that they're supposed to get puffy and puffy? Mm -hmm. When I was in college, there was a, um, one of the... A dumpling in college? Yeah, we used to get fried dumpling on one of the halls. I think Chancellor Hall. They used to make the best fried dumpling. I've been trying to recreate it ever since, but... It's not, the Chancellor? It's not quite there. I'd like to know who it is. The Chancellor. Devana, good morning to you. Good morning to you, girl. Good morning to you jensen beach in the house mm -hmm. i'm early waiting on my plate <laughs> oh boy 
be on the way. I'm sure if you hop in the car now, you will be here in time for the finishing. So. How the color look, guys? How the color look? How we look? How we look? How we look? Look, look. It look good. It smell good. <laughs> <laughs> and by the title of the video, you guys can tell that we're trying to go traditional Jamaican Christmas um, ingredient. Ham. Ham is to Christmas as turkey is to Thanksgiving, at least For in Jamaica. Jamaicans. Yeah, at least in Jamaica. If you have a nice Christmas spread, and unless you don't eat, unless you're an Adventist or you really don't eat ham, eat pork. once, yeah, you really don't eat pork, but once you eat pork and you mess with pig, <laughs> there's going to be ham on your table and a part of your, your Christmas spread. Am I lying? No, you're not. No, you're not. Althea Reed, good morning to you. Jamaica Mark, in yeah. the house. Kingston is in the house. Hey, baby, baby, baby come on. Baby, baby, baby come on. Baby, baby, baby come morning, on. Morning, Althea. Good morning, Althea. Morning, Troy. Moronia, eat something. Don't tell nobody. We need to share this side. All right, so they have puffed it up. So now I'm putting them on their sides because we want every angle to get properly cooked and soaked. Okay, not annoying more than trying to eat fried dumpling and then outside is cooked and inside. Is there anybody who removes the middle? I have a friend, she removes the center of her fried dumpling. Like she breaks it open and take out all of the dough. From the inside and she just eat the outside the crispy part i'm like are you for real i don't have time for that no pork anymore but 15 dollars plus three dollar more with sorrel <laughs> so hold on there without seeing the dish you already are putting a price tag on it okay okay Troy. all right we got them we got them with it with the plate and the sorrel we we got you joy huey omg i have not seen you on in a while miss joy good morning to you miami gardens in the house hey. um south florida is in the house hey big up yourself um you stay about morning i'll say it's mine my comfort before airport lock <laughs> Ah, uh, it's uh, it's here about the center of the dumpling. It's a donut for real. I don't know what it becomes, but I don't like the dough part. If you don't like dough, do not eat dumpling. Mm -hmm. That's that's my recommendation. Leave it alone. But how are you guys doing this Christmas Eve, this beautiful day? It's a beautiful. I mean, it's sunny. I'm not sure if it's hot or if it's cool outside but it's quite windy it looks you know i'm seeing trees swaying left and right so i'm thinking it's a great day outside how are you guys doing let us know single working man is in the house baby baby baby, baby come on all right so Guys, and of course, the dumpling is really not the star of the show. We're just giving you guys a preview, right? Preview. We're saving the best for last. We're leaving the main event for the end of the show, right? So, just just go and feast in the eyes, the show. right? <laughs> the middle of the show. Just go on, go on, take in the dumplings. Go on, take in the, the dumplings. The dumplings look good, you know. I'm not really lie. My dumplings look good. Nobody don't want to admit it, but I'm going to say. The dumplings are all right. -ish. Nobody online saying my dumplings look good, but I am telling you all. In person, it looks great. Go ahead and give a thumbs up if you think these dumplings look great. If you are on and you think my dumplings look great, just close out the chat for a second, hit the like button, and then hit chat, and you're back in the chat. So, go ahead. Stay. Oh, it's too close. Dumpling look good. 
the dumpling them look very nice and golden brown i like them because your hand ain't lacking it though okay. yeah golden brown look at that the guys let me do a zoom on the dumpling zooming on the dumpling zooming on the dumpling hey oh the cherry oh it's zooming on the dumpling all right good morning guys good morning to you it's a beautiful morning we are here because we are here it is christmas eve yes it is i haven't been outside yet but i have to run to the grocery store in a few that's what Devon, devana says it's breast is a breast take breath taking hear me i'm sorry guys sorry sorry i'm sorry me, me, me get tongue tied michael me get tongue tied you said breath taking leave me alone man i'm not next for my leave me alone oh joy blessings to you blessings to you i meant to say breathtaking yes i was reading over what you said michael okay mm -hmm. wait name they say him is official him is an official um citizen um try he says that's the news he's an official citizen u.s citizen passport and citizenship paper and all ladies with visa is you call me now <laughs> oh my try it too early for this it too early for this maz maz good morning to you good morning so as i was saying michael said it's a very breathtaking morning it is it is a beautiful morning outside and it's not hot it's not cold it's just that right level of you know of um temperature all right i have nothing else on my mind leave me alone that that's what i say all right guys so i need to make a disclaimer all right we do have um in our title we say christmas ham we do have our christmas ham however because of the situations that are happening around us this year we are i'm not just i'm not going all out to do no harm and all of that because we're just not gonna do it it's three of us in the in the household and we're not planning to be anywhere else or, or we're not planning to you know we want to we want to share with our family together when that time comes so in lieu of the christmas ham we have another ham hey ha ham a ham all right yeah or you bake it and trust it and set it and fix it and all of those things so because of that now you know, me, me no want to use up that big ham there and then have the, like, like what happened with the turkey. All right? So, ham is ham. Altia read, wait, Altia read, we ain't leave me alone. You see, Altia make trouble, but me say breast taking. Say, Altia, stop. Me never say so. Jeez, why you not say you're here? You're I'm supposed to be on my side. I'm on your side. No, you're supposed to be on my side. You're not supposed to say you're here. Me say that. Ah oh boy, it's just trouble from morning. Peer trouble them are give me, guys. Mm -hmm. So I am doing ham, guys, but it's not gonna be that big thrusty Christmas ham that is dressed and done with nice flavors and ray ray ray. It's gonna be regular ham, okay? And we're gonna do it with our aki because when you in it's Christmas time, aki and selfish is one of the quintessential Jamaican. Well, Jamaicans cook ackee and selfish, but basically every special occasion. Mm -hmm. All right, so every special occasion you're gonna get ackee and selfish. However, around Christmas you may get a little ham squeezed in it. You may get ackee with ham. You may get ham with beans. You may get ham with a little bit of cabbage, stuff like that. Because Jamaicans we are essential um, people, and so we utilize what is what whatever is there. We're gonna make sure we utilize it, Joshua. Good morning to you, sir. In the cupboard, you're gonna give me uh, onion, which is in the in the onion container, in the fridge, in the fridge and, and the scallion. All right, so the onion is in the onion container right there. Yes. Thank you so much, sir. I appreciate you. And the and the and the, the, the scallion. I, I, I can't read the things with my glasses on. Rise up, almighty cook and innovators of Yardy Breakfast. Rise up. <laughs> Hello, good morning. Ah, say Merry Christmas. That's what you're supposed to say. It's, it's Christmas Eve, bruh. Bruh, bruh. Merry Christmas. Eve. Mm -hmm. 
All right, and guys, remember, say the information is in the description box. If you don't want to send a Christmas present, you know, you can send it via the information in the, in the description box or via super chat, don't you see? Because, mm -hmm. yeah, I want my Christmas present. I need my Christmas present. And how are you guys doing? Joshua is in the house. Mazma said Joshua is in the house. Yeah, Joshua? Huh? Maz, Maz, a big yo. You have to say, hey, baby, baby, come on. You have to say that, Joshua. Somebody just sing, Joshua is in the house. You have to say, baby, baby, come on. <laughs> wow, you don't want to say it, Maz, Maz. You don't want to say it. I'm too, I'm sorry. You may get rum cake and rum punch. 99% rum and 1% punch. <laughs> uh -huh. I mean, if you tell you, I mean, if you tell you, try. So that's what we're doing this morning. I, I know you're not seeing what's happening, but we, you know why we prep. But always after this, do a little prep station one away. Do we put, do we put um, um, tomatoes in our, yes. in our ati? Yes. With ham? Yes, sir. I don't know why not, but I don't feel it. I don't feel it. You don't feel it? I don't feel the tomato. And ketchup? No ketchup don't go in Aki. Not, not, no time at all when Aki I cook ketchup going there. This is, that's just a no no. That's gonna be the, the first. What? Anybody else agree? You can't put, you can't put ketchup in a, in a, in a something there. No, because I am. I know, I know fry up am where I make, where I make Aki. And so, I always fry up my stuff before I add the ackee. Like if I'm making ackee and sawfish, I fry up the ackee, the sawfish, and the tomato and everything first, then I add the ackee. Mm -hmm. Likewise, I would do the same with ham. That's what I'm talking about. No, 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 um, no, no, no ketchup. Thank you so much. You see it? Everybody discrediting my Thank you, mommy. Thank you, mommy. Thank, Thank you. you. What do you mean? That's yellow belly. That's um, Audrey mom. You ain't gonna get no uh, no ketchup from her. No, sir. Bo, bo, bo ketchup. No, sir. Ketchup, ketchup. Not a ketchup now going to my backyard. Altia said no ketchup. Thank you. How you feel? How you feel? How you feel? How you feel? Me know you feel terrible. Me know you feel terrible because this morning them not agreeing with you. Guys, check out our Christmas ensemble. Yes. She looks so cute. Belly In her yard belly t-shirt with her Christmas hat. Yeah, she looks so nice. You look so beautiful. Beautiful. And I want you to know you're my favorite girl. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Beautiful. Ooh, 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 oh, yeah. And, and my shirt, my shirt is my tagline shirt. It says Tonya and McFashion. Use what you have to make something beautiful or something good. Mm -hmm. See there? And the back of it have the nice Jamaican something. The Jamaican sign at the back there. So see that? Look there. Yeah. And yeah, it's, yes, it's right there. It's right there. And guys, you can get that on the shop now page. Jadabelli TV. Ma Miss K, good morning. Merry Christmas to you, Miss K. It's a beautiful day. A long time we don't see you in the house. In the house. All right, me soon show on again. Me soon show on the, 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 the suffering. Me soon show on. Just hold on. Hold on a minute. I'm going to show you guys, right? Why are you holding out on the peeps? I'm, I'm, it's, the, it's the suspense of, the, of it all, you know? I'm trying to create suspense. Yeah, so that's why we, we are all out, all out from like that. Don't worry about it. Just soon see what's up. Worry what's worry about a thing. Worry about a thing, Lord. I need a pepper from out of the. I need a pepper. This one has a pepper. Are you have time, babes? Do you have time? It's not on my side. And I put my peppers in the freezer, guys. I put my pepper in the freezer. 
All right, thank you so much, Joshua, for the time. Let me just show you now real quick. This is gonna be like a, a one, two, three dish. Very, very quick, very easy. You know, rapid Sheffield and everything. That's how fast this is gonna be. All right, because guess what? It's a Christmas Eve morning and many people have things to do. You know, some people wait last minute to the shopping and all of that. Me eat shopping, me eat it with a passion, a passion. You understand? So I'm not like do the shopping thing at all at all. You hate going shopping or you hate shopping? The two of them. The two of them. Something else is missing. Um, you have cooking oil over there. Mm -hmm. All right. Take up my tongue because never fry it because Colin can like it when it fry. All right, so we're putting on the pan right now. Let me give you another view of our duck. Oh, what's here? What is here? Make now, you make bake. <laughs> yeah. Look on this, guys. The wife is putting in some flatters. Yeah, she make bake. Flatters matters. Okay. Flat lives matters. <laughs> yeah. And so this is how you you can explore different different options with your with your um. With your dough, you know, you can do a, a flat dough. You this can. This one came out scary. Oh, that would be scary at Christmas. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how the whole skin is. So, this is what's going on right here. See? That look good, don't it? And, guys, I don't know if you, if you are like me, but when I'm cooking, I always are clean. I always are try clean as I go. I don't know if anybody else do that, that type of design, you know? If them built that way, but that's how I do it, yeah. So, all right, let me put this this camera right here, and I'm gonna tilt it so that you can see what's going on over on my side of the stove as well. Watch the the handle and the pot, yeah. Um, maybe, yeah, more, yes, yes, we will. That's, that's how we do it, around here. Greasy, happy, I just made this. Let every heart prepare him room in heaven and nature sing. And guys, we don't know if, if, if anybody else is like my wife, but she is in the Christmas spirit. Oh Lord. Now you can show them my thingy. Let's all show them, man. Oh Lord, man. She overleaf, guys. Too much. She sing, shape, shape. Look, decorate all the house, everything, and it's Christmas thing. I'm like, what? Why though? Why do you like that Christmas thing? Why? Why? You following me today to go shopping? I'm not you crazy. She, she, she might, she's not going anywhere, guys. <laughs> she's not going guys, anywhere. why men think that you can shop in one day? Is it possible? Do I have any females on the live right now? If you're a female, is it possible to do shopping in one day? And is it alarming if you spend like six hours on the road in one day shopping? Man, is, 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 is that alarming? That's a sign of man. That's not no sign. Hmm. There is no reason to be out on the road, Salam. You crazy? It's <laughs> my older brother is a dumping and Aki and Sawfish King in the family. <laughs> do, you, do you want some oxtails for dinner tomorrow? I'm sorry, what? Oxtails. I don't want no oxtails. Wait till you hear they're leave me alone. What? Christmas dear. Uh. What do you want tomorrow? Fish? No! All right, take time. <laughs> take time. <laughs> <laughs> Joshua, tell them say you want wait name, man. You want rotisserie chicken. Rotisserie chicken? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's all Joshua eat. From right. where? <laughs> From Kobe. No. Mm -hmm. He hates that. No, you want ox tail? Me want some, me want some starfish and butter beef. See, that's what you're gonna get, Josh. For dinner, for dinner. 
for dinner. Oh, no, I want corned beef and rice. Yay! <laughs> Go, Guys, my family have no ambition. For Christmas dinner tomorrow, one of them want um, sawfish and butter bean and the other one say no, I don't want that. I want corned beef and rice. Can somebody please invite me to dinner tomorrow, please? <laughs> or drop off my dinner tomorrow? That's just bad. Why are you like I know that? you guys not taking visitors. But can you please, so anybody in the area, please drop off my dinner? Because... You're acting different. Why are you Some like that? You don't life. need to be like that. Where, where's my, where's my um, splatter guard, baby? I have no idea. I've never seen that from when I was born. We need it right now before I put in this because it's going to splatter. I don't know. For real. I don't see it. It's a splatter guard thingy. Oh. We have to put everything. Yes, please. Thank you so much. It has to be washed? <laughs> no, it was... <laughs> Run to the girl, you man. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna put my camera over this side. As a matter of fact, guys, let Give me just me show more? you. Give me the last one. I'm coming. Let me just show you what I have here. All right, so this is our get up for this morning. Again, thanks for the wait. We have some tomatoes. We have half of an onion. We have some scallion. We have a little bit of garlic. We have some thyme. We have pepper, and this is our ham, guys. I had a a sliced ham. This is almost like salami, but it's ham that I had in the freezer and that's the one that I use this um, for this um, menu because I, I didn't, uh, guys, it's not really right for go, for go bake a big old ham and all of that. So we're using ham. So instead of our saltfish, we're doing our ham. So the first thing you want to do with your ham, even if it's a regular Christmas ham, the regular thick ham that we normally would slice a piece of, you just slice it very thinly and, uh, you know, shape it how you want to shape it and then we're going to fry this up. Aki is very good with ham. As usual, Aki is good with bacon. Aki is good with saltfish. Aki is good with mushrooms. I've done Aki and mushrooms. I've done Aki with vegan. Um, aki is good with corn pork. Oh my god. Oh yes, Aki and corn pork. Aki. What do you like your Aki with, guys? Let me know what you like your Aki with. I'll tell um, try said them have ox tails. Saltfish him one, saltfish him get. <laughs> I'll I'll see I said them do ox tails tomorrow too again. The Jamaicans them love the ox tails, see man. Chow. Chow. I have ox tails, you know. I wonder if I should go live and do some ox tails. You think I should, babe? You think I should? Say I should. Alright, so the first thing I'm gonna do is as I as I show you, we'll put our peppers in the fridge, in the freezer. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our ham. Do I put honey on my ham? Not yeah, well. When I'm doing the ham, I do honey ham. But when I'm doing this regular thing, I just do you know regular thing. Regular thing. So now you just basically want to get your ham in the pot, and the idea is that you're gonna try to get it crispy. All right. Let me just show you guys what I have here. All right. So we set the fire on at a regular heat. And I'm just spacing it out, and you want to just get it nice and crispy. A non-stick pot is best to use for this because you know um, it will get sticky and all of that. You know, you know them way there. And especially the um, that um, the big thick slice one. Sometimes they they cure it with sugar. Sometimes in the in the baking process, the glaze that is used has a lot of sugar. So that in itself will cause it to be sticky. So you just want to, you know, nice and, you want your ham nice and, you know, almost crispy for this exercise, all right? So that's what I'm doing right there. And the wife would have said, you, you put the, the ham in cold pots, but yeah, please don't come for me, um, Candy. Not for real. And Aki, as I said before, because of the price and because of how um, well-loved and traditional Aki is, almost every single holiday, every family gathering, every single thing that we are doing, Jamaicans use it as an a, a, a excuse, excuse to, to have Aki. All right? If you have never tried Aki before, it is a delicious fruit. Aki actually takes the flavor of whatever you put with it. And so it is very delicious, but it just, it just, 
almost like a scrambled egg um, consistency. And as I said, it takes the flavor of whatever you put with it. And knowing my wife, this is a little bit of ham. I'm just letting you all know. She normally wants more ham. Don't babe. You want me to put bacon in it? Now, mm -hmm. same thing? It's, I thought it was a, a There's nothing compares to the taste of bacon. Ham nothing. and bacon are the same thing. Nothing. Ham and bacon is the same thing. I don't business if you want to fix. Mm -mm. Not the same thing. It is the same thing. Come on. Why are you fighting me on this? <laughs> it is the same thing. <laughs> Try said no ketchup. <laughs> And with the splatter guard, guys, you save yourself a whole lot of burn. Let me to tell you, you save yourself a whole leap of burn, you know. Because when that's something you have, anytime folks start get hot, and decide to take one flat upon you. No, man. It will do just that. Terrible, terrible thing. All right. So make it stay there and do its thing. All right. Watch it to me, see. Make sure you watch it to me. I'm going to cut up my ingredients with them. Oh, yes, believers. Oi. Oi. No, sir. A little more. Yes, sir. I'm going to life around here. I saved your life. No, sir. One thing I have in the US is $8. Wow. In the UK. Wow. In the UK. Sorry. Sorry. Eight sorry, man. You know, so that's a lot of money. Eight pounds is way more than eight, right? <laughs> ah, it's... Uh, that's on the bun, you know, see? If the aki the bun, you shall not be having a Merry Christmas. That, I mean, the ham. <laughs> no, so I'm going to turn it. You need to turn it? I mean... It's doing the most, yes. It me can't make it crispy. No, it's not gonna work. No, I'm saying it's crispy enough. Oh, but now? Yeah. So So we're looking at this right now. It's coming up to come. Look good, look good, look good. Looking good, looking good. All right, it's ready now. It's ready now for the rest of the stuff. Eh? Now that me I tell you right now. All right, so I have my onion, my scallion, and guys, I'm coming. I'm coming with the camera. I'm coming with the camera. What feels the Hold this to me, baby. The, the splatter guard. Alright, so now I'm adding in my onions, my garlic, and my scallion heads. Alright. The scallion tail. The scallion tail, the, the back there's of the work there. To add some, some niceness to it. And not until you put something else in the oil, the this, 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 um, this side to calm down. I feel certain. You feel threatened now? <laughs> Guys, just be careful. That's all I can tell you. Alright, just be careful. That looks good. How this look, guys? Look nice, don't it? Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. And I have some time. But I'm gonna add a little bit of time. And time is another thing where we where we, 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 we burn you, you know, guys. Time will burn you. You have to be careful with time. Because time is not on your side. <laughs> time is not on your side. Nice. And as usual, I have to clean. I have to go along with a whole lot of splatter from this thing here. And I just have a wipe off my thing. That was some aesthetic. Yes, yeah, so bear with me, guys. 
Lemon or lime juice? What up, though? I don't know. In Aki? And we have some fresh Aki here, guys. This is not um, store bought Aki. This is not Aki from the can. This is no, Aki. What's the thumbnail? We had in our freezer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I don't even remember who gave us that. But it wasn't even pre cooking. I had to boil it this morning. Look at that. And we just have a quick folding. Guys, you can't stir aki too much. You have to fold it in and allow it to do its thing. Yeah, I'm gonna need garlic, black pepper, a little, a little, um, Lars. You have mashed down the place. Alright, so the first thing we're gonna add is some garlic powder all right add some garlic powder and i like garlic guys so i'm, I'm going ham with the garlic powder a little bit no pun intended no pun intended <laughs> i'm going with some larry's seasoned salt again remember that Ham carries a little bit of salt, not as much as, as salt, salt fish, but it does have its salt content. And I'm going with a little bit of black pepper. Black pepper is, is important. <laughs> black pepper is important. Why are you say about quintessential? I mean, I love I'm going to have the country pepper right here. Yeah, the country pepper. I have to put enough pepper. And this pepper was in the freezer, so that's why it look a little bit, you know, used up. And the pepper hot, guys. I'm just like telling you, may I put enough pepper here? Okay. You say, okay? Okay. It's tough have it. Have it. Have it. Have it. Have it. Have the pepper flavor of the country. Sure the aki, you mean? Yeah. Some of must juice. Put some juice in it? No, dry aki protein. That's beautiful. Come in, Ajo. Ah, it's sad. <laughs> dry eyes, even tears. Even my art cries, but who cares? How oh, Aki look? Not good. It looks very good. How oh, the Aki look, guys? Try some crushed red pepper. As every dish. <laughs> you know, say try and the crushed red pepper is the same thing with you and the ketchup, right? Yep. Try it, you just give it yourself. You and the crushed red pepper is the same thing as the wifey and the ketchup. Mm -hmm. Same thing. Every day, crushed red pepper. <laughs> You're supposed to support the crushed red pepper industry heavily. <laughs> and presenting crushed red pepper. Put in my tomatoes. How it look guys, how will our pot looking? Our pot looking like a dis delicious dish. How is our pot looking on this beautiful Christmas Eve morning? Hmm? We ham and we aki. Hmm? How it looking? Looking good, don't it? It look good, it smell good, it's a good as the ham up there. <laughs> I'm going to put a little piece of butter. Yeah, two little pieces of butter in this thing right now. 
Yeah, not tell lie, it looks good to me. It looks real good to me. It looks like Christmas is really coming right now in my pot. Trust me. I feel it. I feel it tomorrow. Christmas is just coming right, right you know. Yes, man. It is so delicious. So it smells so good in here. The house smells so nice. Don't be Very good. I mean, it's happening. It's occurring. It's occurring. As we speak, it's happening. You know? What is your wish for Christmas this year, guys? What are you hoping to have? What are you... What, I mean, aside from Corona gone and, and the vaccine are needed, what is your wish? You know? And how has this year impacted you? You know, what are, what are some of the struggles that you have gotten over? What are some of the innovations that you have gotten? How have you changed your life? Have you done anything new? Have you found any, any resourcefulness that you never had or never thought you had? What's going on with you guys? Let us know. Let us know as we listen to this word from this beautiful young lady. Mm -hmm. I'm giving you the, 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 the camera now, my sweetheart. Oh, you want to put it here? Put it down like such. And then turn it up like such. Demo wear. That's good. Mm -hmm. Right there. Mm -hmm. Good morning again, you guys. Oh, the voice change. This is my business voice. Here we are. Good morning, guys. This is my business voice. And this morning... <laughs> Say it again. <laughs> Say it again. Say it again. <laughs> Uh, this morning, uh, <laughs> oh, you so like the rinse and rails on the radio. <laughs> it's brought to you by none other than <laughs> the mighty, mighty one true natural. One true natural, you guys. Guys, let me tell you something. If you are planning to go into the new year with your unhealthy hair, it's not gonna work, guys. Get it together. You guys need to ensure that your hair is nice and healthy. And especially for those, my, my peeps up there up north, you guys have um, your hair go through a number because of the cold weather. And it's a struggle. It's a real struggle to keep, you know, nice moisturized hair. So, I bring to you as a solution to all of their problems, one true natural, you guys, one true natural. Yes. One True Natural is our very own product line. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. It is designed for naturals. However, the products are suitable for any hair type, whether it is chemically treated or it is natural. It is great because all the ingredients are authentic, um, organic, and all natural. And our first product, of course, it will bring a smile on your face. Shine of Mind, yes. Yeah. Shine of Mind is our nourishing oil blend. You guys can see how nice I'm and nourishing. golden it looks. Mm -hmm. This oil, you guys, is everything. It's suitable for daily scalp nourishment. You guys can use it to massage the scalp, which is very important, by the way, because when you massage the scalp, let me tell you, if you're having issues um, with growth, and you guys think that your hair is not growing. Sometimes the circulation is just not getting to the, the, the place where it gets to the follicles. So you want to actually... The one? The one? Where is the follicles? That's like Santa follicles. Claus L. Yeah. <laughs> so you want to massage the scalp daily. Every day for about 10 minutes. Just go in with an oil on your fingers. And follicle oil. And you want a nice light oil. You don't want anything that's too heavy. And this is perfectly blended. I went ahead and took the liberty of, you know, curating this with a blend of both lighter and heavier oils. So it's suitable for people with thicker and, you know, lighter hair. So, like I said, go ahead, massage that in every day. And that will help to, you know, get the blood flow going. And it will help to stimulate the hair growth. This can also be used as a hot oil treatment mm. on your wash day. Mm. You just warm a little bit of the oil, add, add it to your hair, cover it with a plastic cap, cover that with a towel, leave it on for like 15 minutes, and you will be amazed. 
It has, an amazing, it has an amazing smell because of the secret blend of essential oils. It has a nice therapeutic, very minty fragrance to it. Mm -hmm. And it also is suitable for using on your skin. Again, if you have dry skin or if you just want to keep your, your skin, maintain your healthy skin, mm -hmm. then this product is amazing. All right? Hallelujah. And our premier product, yes, the one that we are super proud of because it stands apart from most other similar products on the market is our very own Jamaican black castor oil. Castor oil, you guys. Yes. Guys, let me yes. see if I can give you a demo. Yes. Because I want you to see, it, it's, it's, all castor oils are not created equal. Look at this. I don't know if you can see. All castor oil. This oil is super I'm thick. not created equal. Awesome. Super thick. You can see the dark color that it has. It has a nutty fragrance that, you know, gives you all the assurance that you need that this is the real deal. Mm -hmm. this, this product we got straight from the farm okay. in... St. Mary, we literally um, know the farmer who grows it, reaps it, uh, Blends extracts it, the oil, yeah. and, you know, supplies it to us, and then we retail it for you guys. And this oil, guys, is amazing for thickness. If you, you know, want your hair to appear thicker, or if you want um, growth, if you want just overall healthy hair, castor oil is amazing. amazing. It's one of the few oils that will on its own moisturize your hair don't take my word for it you can add it to your conditioner you can add it to your styling product you can add it directly to your hair on its own it is a multi-purpose oil that is it's a supernatural oil the bomb okay and this one has no other ingredients added it <laughs> No other ingredients added. A lot of times you would see in the beauty supply store and stuff like that, the oils are, you know, on the cheaper side. And when you check the ingredients at the back, they have other oils um, added. So this one is pure. Nothing else added. No salt, no sugar, no flour, nothing. No okra. <laughs> and then our final product for this year, because next year we come in with more products, you guys, because we are going to be you know um addressing your styling needs so we, this year we are you know addressing your health needs and your nourishment we're going to be addressing also the styling needs so next year look forward to that so the last product in our um, line so far is our castor oil mascara it won't focus but just know that it is similar to a traditional mascara in terms of the packaging it has a typical mascara wand that you can use to apply it you just apply it to your lashes to your brows and this will help to regrow your brows and thicken them and regrow your lashes if you're having issues you know sometimes we put on the fakeness and the fakeness end up do more harm than good so this is the truth so if you guys would like to order, yes, it is also in um, available in a gift set. If you would like to order all three products, it is in a gift set for you guys. And we also throw in a free product there for you guys. www.etsy.com slash shop slash one true natural. The link is in the description bar of the video. And you can follow us on Instagram at One True Natural or on YouTube, One True Natural. And guys, let One True Natural be a part of your life. <laughs> one, my girl. I'm One True Natural, and so are you. Jeez, and peace. <laughs> All with me, Leah. Yes. I'm One True Natural, and so all Uno have to be too. All right, you guys have any questions? Yes, yeah, so Troy has a testimony. He said, I have dealt with dry scalp since childhood after using Shine of Mine consistently. And that's another part. I like, you, I like how you use that word. 
because a lot of times you have people who they buy a product and they use it once or twice and then they complain that it's it's not if effective it doesn't work natural products have to be consistency used. is key you're not going to just take a medicine today and then tomorrow you everything is is fine that's not how things work. unless it's artificial right right so consistency so he said that he after using it consistently i no longer suffer from dry scalp i truly and honestly in caps recommend shine of mine to everyone in caps <laughs> thank you so much try for right. that vote of thanks and something next get fit and done is checking in from saudi arabia big up yourself <laughs> don't you... make it us choke you <laughs> <laughs> So. Ah, God. My girl, how my mm -hmm. thing look? Your thing up there. Your thing look. Come, do, do, Are do. those the best dumplings? Eh? Are there no lighter dumplings? Big. Big. Um, big, 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 sure. Big. I don't see nothing big. wrong with the dumpling. Big, big, big. No, anytime you start dancing, because you get craving, you know. Guys, anytime you see her dance. Name the dance. Name the dance. Craven dance. Butterfly. No, Bogle. Alright, enough, enough, enough. Okay. The people that need to see the finished product. Alright guys, it's all about the food. So time for the food. And here is our dish, guys. Our finished dish. Yeah? And we just to make it nice. How this look, guys? Tell me. How it look, baby? It look lovely. Lovely, lovely. It look lovely, lovely. It need pear. I think it's called avocado, though. It need where must put the pear? Where where upon this can I put the pear? Up here. Hmm. Up here. It's not even up here. Like the pier still on side. <laughs> that looked to me like a trouble. Trouble dead. Eh? Trouble is right there. <laughs> <laughs> my master, when my friend was drunk, he complained of dry scalp and then opened a tin of condensed milk and dash it on his head. <laughs> wow. Wow. I bet you didn't deny that when you wake up. Hmm? I bet you right? didn't deny doing that when you wake up. Of course, wake. you didn't deny it. Here you go. Shai says on the phone with his big auntie and she says, God bless, where's her plate? <laughs> ah, <it's>, uh... <laughs> big up yourself, Carmen Collins. Big up yourself. <laughs> Trudy said, Trudy! True D, good morning. True D? Merry Christmas. Are you kidding me? I haven't seen you in like over a year, it feels like. A lot of late, but <laughs> just on time for my plate. Please and thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Try say, okay, this is an $18 plate with sorrel. So can we get our sorrel, please? So you have $18? Yeah. You know I'm not $18. Try me, try me. $18 your plus tip. You have tried one. I have it. <laughs> guys my plate you guys watch it watch my sample plate you guys it might slide off mm -mm -mm -mm. just got plates <laughs> thursday morning mm -mm. see i'm just thinking that you're gonna make that slap slide off and i'm just scared <laughs> mm -hmm. i'll make it slide off i will pay carmen said i will pay <laughs> Yeah, go ahead, guys, and pay whatever you think this dish is worth. If you think this dish is worth a hundred dollar, go ahead and pay a hundred dollar on Cash App. On Super. <laughs> on Super Chat. <laughs> if you think it worth five dollars, turn on five dollars. Can I get a fork? Oh. You not enough. Why? In that thing. I can't find none. I'm, I'm, these are getting a rise in my breakfast. How am I going to eat a fried dumpling with a spoon? 
Just take it up and bite it. And then you say, I'm going to sell my craving. Yeah, but everybody know you're craving already, see? That's not I'm like... I'm not craving. You're making it look like that's a, that's a, a secret. I'm not craving. Craving. You are always forcing me to taste the food. This morning, I'm never forcing you, I'm just put on the food. <laughs> oh, there's no bacon on it. No ham on it. Hold on. I need to put a ham on it. <laughs> I saw. Thank you, passionate for God. That's better. <laughs> Devana, you know she crib. No, Devana, tell the truth. Yeah, everybody knows mm -hmm. you. What the fun is there? No, Devana is laughing because she knows you're craving. <laughs> Everybody knows you're craving, see? It's, it's, it's like good. A, a understatement. It tastes good? Mm -hmm. You like it? I did a good job? Yep. I <laughs> did a good job. <laughs> oh my god. Guys, I'm looking forward to she's the sampler. <laughs> That's her new name, the sampler. <laughs> so oh oh um web venture not come out yet. Mm -hmm. Web venture busy. Guys, let me tell you something. When Christmas is over and you have that big pretty ham left. Please make sure so you utilize it as best, as best as you possibly can. Remember you can make your gungo peas soup with your ham bone. Remember there's tons of stuff that you can do with your ham, all right? Ham pairs very well for sandwiches. It pairs well as um, for, for, for with mac and cheese, with macaroni um, salad. Oh, we could make some macaroni salad tomorrow. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's all. You need this? Mm. Yeah. Well, you still want axe here? No. I'm not a macaroni fan. You're not getting Joshua some? Mm -mm. Wow. Yes, you see the Raven door? Joshua, you see that? She said she's not getting on. Please don't make it drop, guys. I don't know how to make it drop. No, Josh, go bite, bite it. Is that the whole thing? <laughs> Why are you trying to take it though? Bite it. Come on. All right, feel yourself. Let's see, but that boy show up. Mazma say you're the vacuum, see. <laughs> okay, that's it. This is the last place I'm taking. <laughs> the last place I'm taking. Why are you showing this? For the year. Show it. Did you want to show it now? Last place for the year. Good morning. Passionate for God. It's passionate, Joshua. Passionate. It's that's what I said. No, you said passion eight. <laughs> it says eight right there. Yeah, but you don't say it like that. You say passionate. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Joshua, show, show them the plate again as we you wrap this up. Pepper. You need more pepper? What? Yeah. You are saying you need more pepper? Yep. I have some grace pepper in the fridge. Me use it. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Do I look a close up, Josh? Do I nice look a close up? Your shadow. You, you guys are blocking out the 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 the, um, the light. Just show them my thing, my hot chocolate. You're gonna show them. Show them the hot chocolate station. Put, turn the camera on you, and then go over to the hot chocolate station, and then show them. Okay, I'm gonna show you what my mom made for Christmas. And tell them what is in it. Look, she made a whole hot chocolate like 
shop stand thing. Uh, it has lights and it's on like cotton on like a drawer. In this one, it has like little tiny, little tiny, I can't open it, little tiny candy canes in this one. And this one, it has Christmas cookies, like, like uh, different types of cookies for Christmas. Um, this one is my Christmas cup. And I think this one is my dad's Christmas cup. And go ahead and show them now. And this one is, I think, her Christmas cup. And here she has like a vase full of like chocolate candy canes and mint candy canes. And here she has marshmallows for the hot chocolate and the hot chocolate powder. And she has the boiler for the water. The kettle. That's a kettle. And she has kisses right here. And just and other the decorations. So guys, this is the wife's um, hot chocolate station, as Joshua just said. What do you think about it? She did a good job. We're supposed to be doing hot chocolate tonight and Christmas night and all the other nights. And, you know, just trying to make the, the season nice and stuff and stuff. We're passionate there. Oh, maz, maz. All right. So this is everything that the wife did, you know. And me personally, just I got going at the cookie. I just cookie me one. And yeah, beautiful, right? And then the snow underneath it. Yes, man, just wanting to let you guys know. And when my hot chocolate done, after the hot chocolate is done, through the blessings to you, then we're going to take it to a higher spirit, higher level, higher level. <laughs> <laughs> You see, mm -hmm. when the hot chocolate don't see me, I take it to a higher level. Yeah. Look, higher level, higher level. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. But yeah, man, this is nice. I, I mean, I, I'm totally against Christmas. I don't like it. You know, I'm not against Christmas, but I don't like the season. I, I've never had good experience, yeah. you know. Yeah. And thing, but just I'm just the Grinch, but I must tell you that she did a good job with this, right? And when the lights are off, and think it just look warm and nice. And as usual, I don't know why she give me this big old cup, you know, because she try to say something. She's, I think she's trying to say something to me, you know, either that my craving or something. But may I leave it right there, so yeah. And this is her cup, as Joshua said before. Just want to give you guys a good look. Yeah, the wife did a good job. Big up yourself, wifey. Big up yourself. You did an excellent job with your Christmas decoration. And guys, we see by the clock on the wall that it's time to go. We want to thank you for joining us today. We do pray that you all will have a blessed Christmas. We're gonna sh we're gonna close out with a little word of prayer. We do wish you guys a blessed Christmas, a prosperous new year. We pray that the Holy Spirit will continue to guide each and every one as we continue to seek his face, that we continue to learn from him. We thank you once again for, you know, spending the year with us, you know. Joshua, come here. We thank you for spending the year with us, for, for you know, coming on the journeys with us, uh, going through the, the, the move as we moved from Miami to PSL and, and, you know, weekly coming in our kitchen, giving us your, your take on different things. We, we appreciate it. Come this way, baby. You're in the middle. We're we'll do the Christmas closing. We do appreciate it. It's been a very challenging year. Josh, come in there. Come, come over here, see? Okay, you have the, you the, the rose. I mean, Josh, you the two thorns. Yeah, it's been challenging, but we are here. We have been subjected to everything that 2020 had to offer everything it threw at us but we are here and we thank god for that we thank god for the opportunity to see even this year many persons so many persons have not seen christmas this year but we are here so on behalf of joshua you can find him on instagram at josh the food lover 
on behalf of this beautiful lady. You can find her on Instagram at Candy's Hair Creation or One True Natural. And on behalf of Yada Deli TV, you can find me on all socials at Yada Deli TV. We wish you Merry Christmas and a prosperous 2021. We pray that God will bless each and every one of you, that he, he will make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. We pray that God will lift up his countenance upon each and every one and give you his peace. Once again, we thank you. Joshua, you have something to say? Merry Christmas or something like that? Give a greeting. Merry Christmas. What do you want me to say? Give a greeting. Greet the people for Christmas. Come over in the camera in the shop. Yeah? Come over and see in the shop. Yeah, say something, you know, well wishing. Yeah, this is what we do at Christmas time. We tell people, you know, give them a greeting. So let's go. Merry Christmas, everybody. Happy, enjoy your Christmas. Um, <laughs> have fun. Uh, give some gifts to people. <laughs> 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 Thank you, Joshua. <laughs> and now the, the, the sampler. Go ahead, Miss Sampler. <laughs> anyway, guys, Merry Christmas to you and your families and your friends. And like Joshua said, I like what he said. Give some gifts to people. This year, make it about giving. You know, give up yourself. Don't always expect, but in, in even the smallest way, you don't know the difference that you're making if you just give to the person even the person who you think doesn't need it sometimes they're the people who appreciate it the most so yeah thank you guys for supporting us throughout the entire year you guys didn't have to we have our day one people our people who been there with us through thick and thin every single week we appreciate it oh no all right so all the best for 2021 and yeah we are pressed down but not abandoned <laughs> crushed Something but like not destroyed yes yes and yes. let us look forward for good things for next year this year was challenging but we're believing that all will be well yeah and okay. we keep trusting god we keep trusting mm -hmm. god so on behalf of my family to your family and every single person that watches us have yourself a merry christmas and a prosperous new year a peace we'll on the camera we don't know. <laughs> Watch Joshua. In, 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 no sense, no. <laughs> Why are you tipping? You're trying to be taller than us. I know. He's tipping. No, that's not fair. He be tipping. He be tipping, 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 tipping. Let's do that challenge. I'm not doing anything. I'm uh, 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 challenging uh, uh, the fuck uh, up or something. She's crazy. She's crazy, guys. She's crazy. Call the police. Call the call the police. I think COVID make um, people get mad too. All right. So this is the final look at our delicious aki, Jamaican aki, with Christmas ham. Yeah. Look on that. Eh? Food look good. Not on like. It look good. It tastes good. It a good as the thing up there. It is breakfast material. Why are you dancing over there? I'm not. He look the man just nice. Guys, have yourself an awesome day. Blessings to you all. Have yourself an awesome, awesome Christmas. <laughs>